Hey, this is WebJunior 1977 here, back in the Oasis once again, with another uh, mask review here. Uh, this is the second to last uh, one I'm going to do. Uh, the one, the the one, the Venom one I have. Uh, I don't want to do the review on it yet until I get it 100% complete, because I don't really um, can't really do a definitive review on it without it being complete. So, without further ado, this is probably my all-time favorite mask vehicle, uh, and it's Bulldog. I, uh, this, this was the, the main one I wanted to get back after losing uh, all my mask figures in, in the fire, like I was saying. Um, this, is, this is the one I've been wanting to, wanting to get back, and I finally got it back, so... Thanks to the Greencastle Toy and Collectible Show in Greencastle, Pennsylvania. Make sure you go check that out if you're nearby. Or if you happen to uh, be in the area at the time. Check it out on Facebook You'll for the times, days and times. But anyway, let's get, uh, let's get the uh, driver out here. His name is Boris Bushkin. He is actually a former Venom agent that defected to, to Mask, which is pretty cool. He's one of the coolest and my favorite uh, of all time uh, figures. He's the most detailed. He's got like a, a really um, rustic look to him, um, like a rawhide kind of look to him, um, like a winter look to him. Uh, like a winter clothes look to him. Uh, it looks like he has a metal boot. I don't know if that's like a, a metal prosthetic. Or if it's... Uh, I can't remember the cartoons. I have to watch the cartoons again. I have them. But uh, I don't know if that's like a metal prosthetic. Or if that's just a... You know, a metal boot. But in any event... In any case... Uh, here's his ugly mug. That's Mr. Boris Bushkin. And a lot of people were wondering why he has the M on his head. I, I want to think it's for, stand for mask. Um, I could be wrong about that, since you know he is a, a former Venom agent turned mask. I'm not sure. Maybe he got a tattoo there. Um, I'm not sure. But uh, he is of Russian de Russian descent. Uh, so let's set him here for a second. Let's check out his mask. His mask is like the one of the coolest masks you're gonna see in in the uh, universe of mask here in the in the series of mask. Uh, it looks like a bear. It's supposed to resemble a bear. Is what it's going for. It's got the the uh, molded in hair on the back, which is really awesome. Uh, its name is Comrade. And the and its ability is, it fires energy blast, energy based stars. That visually confuse opponents. Let me say that again. <laughs> it fires red energy blast based stars. That visually confuse his opponents. So basically, red stars, I'm assuming coming from the eyes, because the eyes are red. Again, I, I, I haven't watched the cartoon in a while, the show in a while. I'll have to re, uh, re watch the show again, but yeah. So we'll put this mask back on him, and we'll get to his vehicle. As you can tell, my vehicle is somewhat screwed up. This uh, stack just wants to come out of there it's not necessarily broken it's just i guess you would call it broken but it's like it just doesn't want to stay there but this is bulldog he is part of the racing series of mask in 87 shortly shortly before they actually uh discontinued the show this is one of the last vehicles if not the last vehicle and character uh introduced to the world of mask Again, it rolls really nicely with the rubber tires. 
It's got a lot of chrome, as you can see. Chrome around everywhere. And yeah, this one happens to be 100% complete. Like I said, I'm only going to review them if they're 100% complete. But uh, let's take a look at the back. Um, got the fifth wheel here. And right here, if you can see, is the button. So what this thing turns into is essentially a tank. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit this button. And then we can pull out. We've got some guns here that we can pull out. Right here in the front, you can see the guns. Uh, in the back, we have like a missile tor torrent. That's one of the most common pieces missing is the is the missile, and it does fire. So yeah, we'll put it back in there. Normally, I don't put the missiles back in things due to the springs. Uh, getting weak, but in this case, I normally uh, I do because I don't want to lose it. And then the last part of the gimmick, well, not the last part, but next part of the gimmick is the wheels flip to tank treads. And the tank treads don't actually have any wheels on them. They're still it's still rolling on the actual tires, so it still rolls relatively well. Uh, and also the stacks come down. This one obviously is broke, but you get the idea. Stacks come down. You can put them basically wherever you want them. And then you can plop Boris Bushkin in his seat right here. Close up this. I'm just going to set this off to the side here. And you have Bulldog in his battle mode. So, yeah. Really awesome figure. Really awesome. Uh, vehicle like i said it's my favorite all-time vehicle uh that i wanted to get back and lo and behold here it is so yeah really highly recommend this vehicle if you're a mask figure if you're a mask figure collector or mask uh toy collector um really high, highly recommend this one it's a little pricey sometimes i got this one for like 60 bucks because of the the stack being broke but uh Still, all in all, great, in great shape, so I'm pleased with it, so. So, yeah, that's Bulldog, also known as Bulldoze in the in the UK, but, uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, everybody. Got one more review to go here, and, uh, yeah, got one more review to go, and until I get my uh, last one 100% uh, complete. So make sure you stay tuned. Make sure you check all the descriptions in the links in the links below. The links in the description below, and uh, show them all some love. Um, subscribe to all of them. Also subscribe to me if you so choose. I'd appreciate it. And by doing so, that will enter you, make you eligible for the giveaway at 400 subscribers. Like I've been saying, I'm getting closer, and closer. Um, hopefully. Hopefully going to hit that soon. That way I can go ahead and do it this week sometime. So be looking out for that. And of course, as always, thanks for watching everybody. And until next time, I'll meet you right back here in the Oasis.